In the beginning, there was nothing, no sky, no sea, only silence, and a darkness deeper than time itself. Then, a ripple, a tremble in the void. 13.8 billion years ago. The universe was born in a flash of unimaginable power. From a single point smaller than an atom, energy exploded outward, time began, space stretched. From this storm of fire and light the building blocks of all things were forged. Hydrogen, helium, the simplest elements dancing in the newborn cosmos. I am light. I travel forever. I illuminate the path. Galaxies swirled into being. Stars were born, lived, and died in brilliant explosions, supernovae, scattering their ashes across the void. From the dust of dying stars, something new began to stir. 4.6 billion years ago, a swirl of gas and dust spiraled around a young flaming star, our sun. Gravity took its brush and began to paint planets from cosmic clay. I pull all things to form. I bind the chaos into shape. The third planet, small, rocky, battered and boiling, was Earth. She was not born gentle. She was forged in fire and fury. Molten rock churned. Meteors rained from the heavens. The moon was torn from her side by a colossal impact. Time passed. Millions of years like grains of sand through celestial fingers. Earth cooled. Steam rose from the crust as water formed. Rain fell for centuries, carving rivers into rock, cooling into the first oceans. The stage was set. I cradle potential in my depths, I remember all beginnings. And then, in the cradle of water, lightning struck, molecules danced, elements joined hands, and in a moment so small it almost didn't happen, life began. I am fragile, but I endure. I grow from the tiniest spark. Single-celled organisms swam in ancient seas. For billions of years they were alone, evolving, adapting, multiplying. They learned to breathe, to harness light, to build the foundation of a living world. 2.4 billion years ago, tiny architects of change, cyanobacteria, began to exhale oxygen. The air changed. The sky turned blue. Oceans shimmered with new chemistry. Some life perished in this new world, but others evolved, multicellular life emerged, worms, corals, jellyfish. Then in a Cambrian explosion, life bloomed in a thousand forms. I do not rush, I sculpt life across eons. Earth wore many faces, forests of ferns, continents drifting, mountains rising and falling like breath. Then came the giants, the dinosaurs. For millions of years they ruled the Earth. But fate is never still. 66 million years ago, a rock from the sky changed everything. I am the bringer of ending and beginnings. The age of reptiles ended in fire and ash, but in the shadows, small warm-blooded creatures survived. Mammals. Time turned again. Through deserts and forests on trembling legs, a new creature emerged. I stand, I wonder, I remember the stars. Homo sapiens, thinkers, dreamers, builders. They painted stories on cave walls, tamed fire, asked questions of the heavens. They were children of stardust and they began to understand their origins. You are of me, and to me you shall return. Now we gaze back through time. Telescopes stretch our eyes into the past. Satellites whisper secrets of Earth's birth. We are storytellers of atoms and galaxies, caretakers of a fragile world. Planet Earth, 
Born in violence sculpted by time, cradles life in a cosmic void. She spins still, blue, alive and dreaming. We are Earth, and Earth is the universe made aware of itself. From nothing came everything and in everything we find our story.